and to the people of the Republic of Kenya, the first budget of the Kenya Kwanzaa administration under the order, order members. Minister, proceed. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. It is a great honor and privilege for me to present to this August House and to the people of Kenya. Mr. Jogun Alum, who has come to make some speech. But you have walked out on him on basically two accounts. One is to protest against the very, very <coughs> arbitrary manner in which uh, the debate and the final vote on the finance bill was undertaken yesterday. We feel it was obviously rushed uh, to, to, uh, to achieve a uh, predetermined uh, uh, objective. Debate would be had on uh, yesterday morning, yesterday afternoon, and today the whole morning. You all had it and suggested, including in consultation, that the voting would come next week on Tuesday. For that reason, it is inconceivable that a member could stand under standing order 95 and the speaker accedes to stop debate and go to the voting. That is the irregularity that our leader of minority is talking about. It is improper to mislead members of parliament, to mislead the media and to mislead the nation. 